He thinks Cherie here can give him the neon treatment. That is, unless the old gray married what she used to be. <laughs> Pat, you should play gone with the wind. But for good, you should be gone. Yeah, save them cracks for your pictures. So you see, Mr. Nassau, by the time I pour him back in a train, he's... And this is the point, Potts. And you two might listen. I'll tell it as simply as I can. Who knows, you might get it. We're trying to put over a pretty fast deal. It's conceivable that the sheer novelty of your drivel may daze him for a short time. He might bore him to death. Yeah, but George, I'm not in. He knows that Miss Cherie and Mr. Kozlovsky are here. Yeah, well, well, I ain't here. Now listen, both of you, and concentrate hard. Quintain knows more about the picture business than any of us. We fooled him so far because this is not picture business. It's hijacking. Ah, oh, the genius. So, Quintain, glad to see you. You're a liar. Nice going, girly. My dog. Listen, you've got a picture to finish, or maybe it slipped your mind. I cannot shoot without the man. Oh, don't give me that. From the start, this picture smelled from herring. First, it was writers, dozens of them. Then your cameramen. You shoot five weeks with a guy that's been photographing you since 1898. And just because he can't squirt elixir of youth out of his lens, you start from scratch with a new boy. Oh, Doug, you know... I know you've stalled a million bucks extra load on the picture. Naturally, New York's got a yen to know what's the matter. Well, get this. I'm not taking the slap for it. You're the producer, aren't you? He's just your director. She's just... Yeah, what have you got to do with this? Or have you? Say, listen, Chisler, if I thought you had your slimy oh, paws on this... Oh, Pour yourself a drink. Doug, you don't expect me to play a love scene I don't feel. Love scene's the way you feel them. Look, Camille, they've got senses, or maybe you haven't heard... Oh, listen, baby. Why don't you quit this racket? You're poison at the box office. Finish the picture and give up gracefully. Kozlowski, you directed a good picture once. Why don't you prove it was no accident? I do not argue with peasants. Oh, so it's like that, eh? Okay. Well, get it up off there and shoot your love scene. Smell up the joint good, but close the picture. That's or else. You forget that my contract gives me approval of cast, direction, cutting... You're telling me about your contract. I'm the cluck that gave it to you. Sure, everybody in Hollywood knows it. To a dame I was in love with. So help me, I'm still in love. Doug, please. Oh, Doug, now you're not going to start that again. One drink and you're on a bang. So what? But so you washed up. Just another guy that jumped in a gin bottle and pulled the cork in after him. Ah. All right, go ahead. Ruin your life, my life. But this time you'll bail yourself out. A charming domestic scene. 